Y'all spoil. Some of y'all spoil. Just bottom line. Your parents have done everything for you. You never had to do nothing for yourself. You're spoiled. We're going to keep it real tonight. Some of you are spoiled brats. Every time you ever got in trouble, somebody in your house got you out of it. Every time you've done something you're not supposed to do, people say, Eric, your mother's a tyrant. You're right. She kicked me out. You're right. She's mean, but she developed a man because she put me out there and said, you're going to have to grow up. And some of you have never learned to grow up. And so every time something get hard, you quit, you call mama. I dare you to take a little pain. I dare you. I dare you not to go home. You ain't going to die at the end of pain and success. You're not going to die because you're feeling a little pain. I'm not eating like I eat at home. That's why you're about to go to the next level, because if you keep eating like you ate at home, you will keep being a boy or a girl. It's time to become man, woman. I love my life. Y'all got to start loving your life. And whether you make it to the league or not, you are not who you are because of the league. You are who you are because of who you are. And if you make it to the league, then the league is going to be blessed with your presence. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Be comfortable on who you are. Be comfortable if y'all poor. If you come from a family right now that's broke, you use that, use that to your advantage. I use that to my advantage that I was a high school dropout, that I was homeless, that I ate out of trash can. I, I love dealing with a dude who think because he come from money, he better than me. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. You got money, but do you got that dog? Yeah, you got money, you got privilege, but do you got that dog? Can, do you got that stamina? So yeah, you might have something I don't have right now, but if I work hard, I can have what you have.